What's going on, family? Welcome to the corner, to the blue corner, baby. The man to man, let's talk. We in the blue room right now. And I just want to share some words with you uh, about what we're about to go into, into our new normal. Listen, here's the deal. We're not going back to normal. All right, newsflash. If you ain't figure it out by now, we're not going back to normal. You know, normal is what got us to where we are right now. It's time for us to move on. It's time for us to do what is best for us. And the key thing is is we have to accept that that what's in the past is in the past and we have to move forward. Now, whatever plans that you have, you can throw those plans out of the way, adjust your sail, and just go along with what's to come. And I promise you, God has a plan for you just like he has a plan for me. And his plan is better than the plan that we have. So let's be real with it. Our new normal is actually going to be better for us. It may not look good for us on the surface, but you best believe it's definitely better for us. Listen, one of the things that we have to identify are the distractions that are around us on a regular basis. I encourage you as always to pay attention to the TV shows that you watch, the music you listen to, the books you read, the people you hang around. That makes a world of a difference in which direction that you're going. Think about it. If we don't pay attention to those things, then they're going to consume us and it's going to take us off our designated path. We have to pay attention. And the other thing that's important through this whole process is understanding how the world operates as we go into this new new normal. The world has an agenda, but God has an agenda that's greater than the world's. Do you know what God's agenda is for you? Yo, let me break it down to you like this. The way we've all been brought up, we've been brought up to be more workers and doers than feelers. And what I mean by that is our culture and in this country, it's all about work, 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 work. And it's less about feel, 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 feel. We suppress so much. We suppress who we really are and who God has created us to be. And that suppression leads to depression, which leads to problems. So we need to know who we are who we belong to, and how we're supposed to operate as human beings. And the challenges that we're going through right now, the reason why many people are having a hard time adjusting is because it has less to do with work and more about being a human being. The emphasis has always been on work, 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 continuing ed classes on work, you know, try to promote yourself in corporate America to be the best that you can be in the workplace. But how often do we hear Be the best human being that you've been created to be. And how many classes that we have taken to be the best human being that we can be. Now, what worked for you at last year's age may not work for you this year. So that means you have to learn all the time. That's the emphasis that we're talking about here is on being a better human being. In order for us to appreciate and see the value in this new normal we're going to, We have to learn every day to be the best human being God has created us to be because the world's agenda is to work ourselves to death. Well, God's agenda is to serve him to death. Hey guys, thank you so much for spending a few minutes with me as I share some of the words with you that hopefully it empowered you so much. Thank you for joining me here in the blue room in the blue corner. And I ask that you please hit that like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel. I'm telling you, you won't be disappointed. If you're looking for some encouragement, some empowerment, some excitement, and something just to put a smile on your face, you come to the right place. Right here with Man to Man, let's talk of Eugene Johnson Jr. Man, I love you. Ain't nothing you can do about it. And just remember, let's enjoy this new normal we're going into because it's going to be a blessing for us if we look at it from the right perspective. Subscribe, like, and share. Take care. Man to man, let's talk.